After the war, uh, Alan Turing then worked in Manchester University in the UK, and he continued his work in computing, in artificial intelligence, and in mathematical biology as well. Uh, in particular, why do you get a Fibonacci number of spirals in a sunflower? That was something he was interested in. What I've got to finish with is a little quote from one of the other code breakers at Bletchley Park about Alan Turing. Uh, this is from Hugh Alexander, really his sort of second in command, who said, there should be no question in anyone's mind that Turing's work was the biggest factor in Hut 8's success. He says Hut 8 there, you could say Bletchley Park as well. In the, only, in the early days, he was the only cryptographer who thought the problem was worth tackling. Other people had given up. He was still trying to break this code. It is always difficult to say if anyone was absolutely indispensable, but if anyone was indispensable, Alan Turing was.